This video is going to help you with the lab that we did in class called Modeling, Transcription, and Translation. And I think the hardest parts of this lab um, will be question maybe 14 and 15. So we are going to go right to that. Question 14 and 15. Question 14 says, what would be the tRNA sequence what would be the tRNA sequence uh, that would code for a protein consisting of the following amino acid sequence? Leucine, glutamine, tyrosine, leucine, serine, serine. Now, I don't expect that you can necessarily read what's on the screen, but I do want you to be following along on this lab. So for question 14, uh, they're giving you an amino acid called leucine first. So you look in your lab at the table that was given and the table has a very small font, and looks like this. So you look up leucine. Boy, that's really hard to read. Uh, leucine is the fourth one down on your table. And I cannot even read it on the screen, I'm sorry to say. But you look it up on your table, and you find out that leucine, the code is... AAU. And then you look up glutamine, and the code is GUU. You look up tyrosine, and it's AUA. You look up leucine again, and it's AAU. And you look up serine and serine twice in a row. Why twice in a row? Well, that's just the code. That's just the sequence of amino acids for this protein. So that would be your answer, and I think that's actually pretty easy to understand. All you have to do is look at the table. All right. Um, now, 15 says, what will be the tRNA sequence if a ribosome receives the following mRNA sequence? So here's what's important. What will be the tRNA sequence? They are asking for bases. What will be the tRNA bases if a ribosome receives the following messenger RNA sequence of bases? Okay, so I want to give my answer in bases for tRNA. So this is question 15. It goes on to the next page. So what I've got to do is I've got to look at my messenger RNA sequence that they gave me. Here is my messenger RNA sequence. It's AAA, GCA, GAA, and GUU. Again, I don't expect that you can read this on the screen, so just use your lab. All right, well, uh, if this is my messenger RNA, what would be the tRNA bases? UUU, GCU, CUU, CAA. Okay, now the important thing is I was asked for the tRNA sequence. So that means the sequence of bases. Okay. The next question, 16. What will be the sequence of amino acids for the above tRNA code? So this is my tRNA code. What amino acids does this code for? Well, you got to look at your table and look up UUU. If you look up UUU in your table within the lab, it codes for lysine. If you look up GCU, it codes for arginine. If you look up CUU, it codes for glutamic acid. And if you look up the last code, which is CAA, that codes for valine. So that's how you do that part of the lab, okay? The next part of the lab is just asking you to fill in the messenger RNA code that would match up to the, AT, the uh, DNA. So you fill in the messenger RNA code, and then you look at this code, and assume that this code is going to the ribosome and transfer RNA will meet up with it. 
what's the tRNA that's going to meet up with this messenger RNA? And finally, what amino acid would be carried by this tRNA? So I'm going to do the first one for you. The messenger RNA codon I would get from looking at the DNA. So it's going to be UUA. All right, so now if this goes to the ribosome, transfer RNA is going to meet up with it. What would that tRNA be? It would be AAU. What amino acid will this uh, tRNA be carrying? Look in your table, look up AAU, and it is going to be carrying leucine. And that's how you do that part of the table, okay? So we're starting in the nucleus. This is in the nucleus. And then uh, this is copying the code in the nucleus. And then the messenger RNA goes to the ribosome where the tRNA is. And this is going to be carried by your tRNA. All right. Good luck.